Now, a number of gymnasts have blamed Gettert for enabling Nasser, one calling the pair a dynamic duo after Nasser was sentenced back in 2018. Jason Colthorpe spent the day talking to survivors. He joins us live in Diamonddale with their reaction to Gettert's death. Jason. Well, and as those allegations and charges started to pile up, Gettert's gym, which used to be here in the summit, Twistar's gymnasium, started to crumble. And his death today left survivors with sadness, sadness for Gettard's family that he leaves behind because they it was a tight community. They knew them well, but also sadness for the fact they are not going to get answers now or accountability. My initial reaction was di complete disbelief. And then it was sadness and anger. Emily Meinke has a lot of emotions when it comes to John Gettard. He was her coach from a very early age at Great Lakes Gymnastics Club. She started seeing Larry Nassar at age eight, and the abuse began at age 11. It would last 15 years. And I do think it was partially his responsibility to know what was going on inside those doors. Um, you know, John and Larry were best friends. And I think that, I don't know if that clouded his judgment um, or he truly didn't know. Um, that's something I think that we'll never find out. I literally couldn't believe it. Rita Weber's daughter, Jordan, started winning national championships out of Twist Stars in 2006 under Gettert, culminating with Olympic gold in the London Games in 2012. This latest scandal, though, reminds Weber that they were surrounded by criminals at all levels. It is just something I would never imagine would be part of this whole um, gymnastics career that, that you put your child into and expect it to be, you know, a great ride. She was expecting the charges today against Gettert, but not this outcome. I guess I just would have thought John would have um, fought, you know, fought for his innocence. And so it made me think, okay, maybe he, you know, maybe he wasn't innocent. I, I mean, who knows? But um, I know that um, I definitely think that there were some punishable things. I do think that it was in some ways a cowardly way out of this. Um, I think that he clearly was not able to face the charges, face all of us, face any of the gymnasts that he's ever wronged in the past. Gettert left uh, Great Lakes Gymnastics, by the way, to start Twist Stars in the late 90s. He'll always be linked with Jordan Weaver because his rise in gymnastics was on her coattails and culminating, as you mentioned, Devin, earlier as he became the head coach for the U.S. Olympic team in her Olympic Games. Jordan, by the way, is now the head coach uh, for gymnastics at the University of Arkansas. Her mom told me that she, when she got the news today, she was just as shocked as everyone else. We're in Diamonddale tonight. Jason Colthorpe, Local 4. Just an incredible, incredible turn of events. Okay, Jason, thank you.